Their manipulative tactics did not work on you. You were too in tune. You were too aware. You saw right through them. You saw them through your spiritual eye. You saw what they were doing. You saw their agenda. You saw how fake they were being with you. You saw how they were projecting. You saw how they were gaslighting you. You saw how these were narcissistic people. You saw how some of these people were sociopathic people. You saw them for who they are. Not everybody was able to see them, but you saw them. So finally, they came across somebody that saw them for who they are, saw them in the spirit, not through the flesh. That's why they were so frustrated. Because their manipulative tactics that they tried to use on every other person to get what they want, they didn't get what they wanted with you. They tried to manipulate their way and they did not get what they wanted from you. You may have given in a couple of times, but majority of the time, you refused. You said no. You didn't give in to that temptation. You did not give in to their manipulation. You did not sway yourself because of their manipulative tactics because you saw right through them. So what was happening when you're dealing with narcissistic people, when they cannot manipulate somebody, when they are not getting what they want, their ego faces a bruise. Their ego faces what they call narcissistic injury. I'm doing everything, like the narcissist is like, I'm doing everything that I can to get what I want, to manipulate you, to get what I want from you. How dare you not allow that to happen? Their, their ego just gets bruised because of it. And a lot of times... Your response was a real legitimate response for someone that was in that predicament. It's like these people mistreated you. They bullied you. They, they hurt you. They, they did so much. And then when they finally came back around to try to play the victim or try to apologize and it wasn't really sincere and they tried to manipulate you once again just to kind of get you to think, oh, if I, if I apologize, if I say sorry, it's going to just eliminate everything that I just did and hopefully that works. That's how, that's how their brain is wired. That's how they think it works, but that's not how life works here. But when you are a person, when you realize like, look, I don't give a damn about your fake ass apology. Because it's not sincere. It's not apologizing because you feel remorse for your wrong actions. You're saying an apology because you feel like that this is going to eliminate the, the damage that you've done. You're saying an apology because you think that this is what I have to do. You're doing it out of obligation, not out of true sincerity. Because you could feel the energy from them and you feel like this person is not remorseful. This person is not really sorry. They're just, they're going through the motions, but they're not really, the energy is not aligned. And you felt that. You were so in tune with their energies and they were getting pissed at the fact that people were figuring them out. That's all it was, baby. You were just figuring them out. You weren't taking their tactics. You weren't allowing yourself to be manipulated by them because you saw right through them. You were using your discernment and you may have taken the heat for that, but at least you didn't lose your dignity.